kind of getting some Eve vibes right now. Are you feeling Eve? I have no idea what you mean. What's the latest you can tell us about Life Size? I can tell you that we are working on an amazing script. I've been hitting up Miss Lindsay Lohan in her DMs like, yo, you, you in, boo? And I think she is excited to come back. So Has she said yes yet? I, uh, Pretty much. Did she, Lindsay? I think she did. <laughs> Can yeah. you imagine that these two characters are all these years later? Well, the weird thing is Eve's kind of stuck in time. Um, so she's going to be a little older, but hopefully not looking that much older. Whereas when Lindsay started, I mean, she was a little 10-year-old girl. Now she's a woman. So we have to evolve that and figure out who she is today. When you first made that movie, did you ever think that all these years later, fans would be like desperately wanting you to do it again? Not at all. In fact, I turned down Life Size 2. I don't know if I've said that personally, 15 years ago. Really? So this was already in the works and you're like, ah. I turned it down. Why was that? Because I thought, you'll just have to hear about this later yeah. in a book coming to a bookstore near you in 2018. How amazing. Yeah, I talk about it in books. You have so many amazing things going on right now. And I've got to tell you, this has been the best season of America's Got Talent because you've been such a great support system. When people yeah. get kicked off the show, you're the first person that they see. What has that been like for you? It, you know, it's, it's, it's like the mom skills come out, you know? It's like I'm hugging, I'm sopping tears. Sometimes you don't see in the, in the edit, but I'm like taking my shirt and sopping. Or if kids are crying, you know, we don't really show that on TV, but if a kid is crying, I'm getting them to chant, everybody messes up, everybody messes up, everybody messes up. And it just makes this better. And we're going to come back later. We're going to do good, you know? So it's just constant love and affection. I love that. And you're a mama yourself now, too. What has that been like for you? Yeah, I'll, I'm in heaven with my little pumpkin. Yeah, my heart is on the outside, and he walks around. And I'm like, oh, my heart. What has been the most surprising aspect of motherhood that you've discovered? I don't know. Uh, just how you can love something so much. Almost, and you just, like want to wake this being up in the middle of the night to cuddle with it, but know that you shouldn't. Yes. <laughs> You've been balancing motherhood with uh, America's Next Top Model, with America's Got Talent. What has that been like for you? Um, actually, because I do things in chunks, I'm trying to do things in chunks now and ha not have them overlap. So that helps. It's like America's Got Talent. Then we take a break. Then I go teach at Stanford. Then I take a break. Then I do Top Model. Then I take a break. Back to America's Got Talent. You know, so it's chunks as opposed to layers.